Autodesk are updating their software at quite a rapid rate. Uh, in past years, uh, you just have uh, you know one big update a year. Uh, now what they're doing is they're having a, a point or dot uh, dot upgrades. Um, so at the moment we're sitting in AutoCAD 2018.1.2. Um, I think an update has just um, just arrived, and it just helps to stabilize the software more as um, as more you know, if any problems are picked up. So um, development is is working quite quite hard on that. Um, so just you know with with upgrading, I think it's a, it's a great idea as as they also are putting in quite a few enhancements um, as 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 each uh, you know service pack or or hotfix update uh, comes up. The one that I really enjoy is the new view. Um, you know, creating a view for your uh, um, for your 2D. So under your view tab over here, you'll see there. You know, you've got your named views, uh, top, bottom, left, right, back, front, um, and under there you've got a new uh, a new view over here, which defines a new view. So if I select new view, it brings us up over here. Give it a name. I'm going to say uh, maybe 270 degrees. I'm going to Take this right hand and just make it 270 degrees. Um, let's go define a window. Okay. And define that that's going to be my view over there. Right click and okay. Okay, so now what I've got is I've got that view that has been created with. So very quick, very easy. Um, but what can we do with this now? Um, with this view, we can actually go and quickly create a, a, a view in your um, layout. So I'm just going to go back there. One thing you would have noticed over here, um, if you're not on the latest uh, 2018 AutoCAD, is that there's a little grip in the middle of the year. So this grip allows you to very quickly and easily, by clicking on it, uh, move your, your viewport around. And then the little drop down arrow allows you to change the scale. So you can go change the scale to anyway, 1 is to 5. You know, whatever it is over there. So I'm just going to place it in the top left-hand corner there. So the view that we created, how can we now use this? If I go to my layout, you'll see under my layout viewport, named, um, no, sorry, my apologies, uh, insert view. So click on the drop down, and you'll notice there, there's my 270 degree that I, um, I created. Select it, bring it down, before placing, right click, and change the the scale of it and pop it in over there. So that's two is to one and it's exactly how I want it to look. Now what happens if I had not created that new view over there? Um, if I select under um, insert view you'll see that I've got new view. So with new view what that allows me to do is for instance go back to my model space, get the view that I want and then place it. Right click, put in your scale, and click to place. So just another way how Autodesk is, is making our lives a lot easier um, and making it a lot quicker for us to generate drawings in AutoCAD. Thank you very much for listening.